Georeferencing. It is the process of assigning real-world coordinates to a raster image or scanned map so that it can be viewed, analyzed, and queried with other geographic data. ArcGIS provides tools for georeferencing raster data, which involves identifying a series of ground control points that link locations on the raster dataset with locations in the spatially referenced data. The georeferencing tools on the georeference tab allow you to georeference any raster dataset, and generally, you will georeference your raster data using existing spatial data, target data, such as georeferenced rasters or a vector feature class that resides in the desired map coordinate system. The process involves identifying a series of ground control points, known X, Y coordinates, that link locations on the raster dataset with locations in the spatially referenced data. Control points are locations that can be accurately identified on the raster dataset and in real-world coordinates. Once the ground control points are identified, the raster dataset can be transformed to the desired coordinate system and saved as a new georeferenced raster dataset. Georeferencing in ArcGIS has several benefits, including accurate location. Georeferencing allows for the accurate location of features on a map or image by assigning real-world coordinates to the raster image or scanned map. Easy sharing of spatial data. Georeferencing facilitates the easy sharing of spatial data among people who can then use it for different purposes, including decision-making and documenting among others. Easy location of features. Georeferencing allows for the easy location of a particular house or business by providing its coordinates and description among others. Comparison. Georeferencing is especially useful for comparisons against other geographic data and historical data. Merging data. It is easier to combine different forms of data together if they have been georeferenced, for example, satellite or aerial imagery with terrestrial laser or SLAM data. Georeferencing tools in ArcGIS with description. 1. Georeferencing toolbar. This toolbar is used to georeference raster and CAD data. It has a collection of drop-down items and interactive tools that allow you to add control points zoom in and out, and save your georeferenced data. 2. Rectify command. This command allows you to create a new raster dataset that is georeferenced using both map coordinates and spatial references. 3. Resample tool. This tool is used to change the resolution of a raster dataset. It is often used in conjunction with georeferencing to ensure that the resolution of the georeferenced data matches that of other spatial data. 4. Link table. This tool allows you to link a table of control points to a raster dataset. This is useful when you have a large number of control points and want to keep track of them in a separate table. 5. Warp tool. This tool is used to warp a raster dataset to fit a new coordinate system. It is often used in conjunction with georeferencing to ensure that the raster dataset is accurately aligned with other spatial data. 6. Rubber sheeting. This tool is used to adjust the position of a raster dataset by stretching or compressing it. It is often used when the raster dataset has significant distortions that cannot be corrected through georeferencing alone. Overall, these tools provide a range of options for georeferencing raster data in ArcGIS, allowing for accurate location and analysis of spatial data.